Well, hi everybody. This is Santi for the first time from JustSpain.com. I just wanted to review the new Marin Brilliant colors. Uh, they're really exciting. They, I'm just going to show you the palette I got. And we have each individual color and the palettes uh, at Just Spain. Uh, one of the first things that uh, Marin has done is improved a lot their formula on their metallic colors. Their metallics used to be a little kind of flaky, a little bit powdery. Now they are really, really nice, really creamy like the rest of their line of paint, like the matte colors. So they have developed eight new colors. Their names are in French and uh, English, but it's basically gold, silver, purple, a baby blue, fuchsia, dark blue, green, and orange. Uh, I have made a swatch of all these uh, eight colors. So for you to see here on my skin pad, um, one thing that I notice is that this silver is amazing. I mean, really, it's just, I think it's the best silver I have tried so far. Uh, I wanted to compare it next to Fab, and I haven't done it yet, so we'll do it together here. So that's Marin's uh, new Brilliant Silver, and this is Fab. And one thing that I... I have had in the past is like I love the fab silver but it does kind of take extra work to make it uh, opaque um, you see and then once you get it it's it's a really really nice silver but my thoughts about the Merrill one is that it's just so much easier to go you know and just get an opaque coverage right there one swatch you don't need to do much uh, so I think it's a great great silver I will be really recommending this silver to anybody that needs to do a great coverage. What they basically did is that they made those Marin powders that are great uh, and they turn it into a face paint, which is awesome. Um, also their gold is really, really beautiful and I wanted to compare it to their metallic powders, to the Marin metallic powder gold. So I just, here you can see a swatch of that. and. Man, it's it's just the same. And again, it's like they turned this awesome metallic powder into uh, a water-based paint. So the coverage is just great. Uh, the next color I was really impressed with, super, super beautiful color, is their, uh, their fuchsia. Uh, as you can see it on this swatch, this fuchsia is just beautiful. And I sprinkle a little bit of powder on top, but see how opaque, see how... Uh, it's just like bright and it's more, I would call it more like magenta and it's kind of comparable to the Fab uh, Shimmer Magenta. Uh, it's just not iridescent. Uh, so it's just one solid color versus the Fab that has a beautiful iridescent kind of uh, idea. And I'm not, let me move these. Uh, but you see also the Fab, it takes a little extra more work. You have to make it very creamy. Uh, uh, they're both beautiful colors, but man, it's a really, really solid coverage, this brilliant fuchsia, so I would strongly, strongly recommend it. Um, and then they, come, they came up with a new shade that they're using now on, on Glitter Mark, on, on regular glitter, and on their uh, new uh, Brilliant line, which is called the Harvest Orange, or Brilliant Orange. And it's here, that's the one. And I think, and I again, I haven't tried this, so we'll try it together. It's pretty similar to the Fab Ploppy Orange. At least it looks like it in the container. Uh, so this is the Fab Ploppy Orange, and that here is the Paradise Brilliant Harvest Orange. And no, really, Ploppy Orange, thumbs up, a lot nicer. Uh, I think it's, it's a darker color, uh, but a lot brighter. This, uh, the Meron one, it's more, it's like a lighter, it's like a lighter, more like maybe a kind of a pumpkin. I'm not sure. Uh, but anyhow, not too exciting. I wasn't too impressed by the green. It's a nice green, but uh, much better than the hot rod green in consistency, but nothing uh, much different than anything that is available out there. Same with their baby blue, their regular, their, their brilliant blue and their brilliant 
uh, violet or purple. Uh, they're really nice shades, but not so different from other shades available. So gold and silver, really thumbs up. Great color they did, amazing coverage. Uh, same with the fuchsia, really, really nice color, great coverage. So that's kind of all I have to say about these colors. You can tell me what you think about them once you get them and start trying them out. Um, also let me know what you think about the review. Uh, so maybe I can do more reviews like this more often and compare colors and shades and all that. Uh, and, and if I'm not good at it, just let me know too so I can uh, definitely stop doing it. All right. Thank you so much. Thanks for watching.